The forward march of progress continues with some nice usability improvements. Activating the top or bottom bar now has haptic feedback, as well as opening and closing apps. A testing version of the keyboard now also includes haptic feedback. We are also close to including haptic feedback in calls now that Feedback D respects the sound theme. The calls UI is now much cleaner and has user-friendly error messages. The contacts list is also better displayed as well. The top dropdown has been modified to include system messages. Now notifications have a place to gather. A new animation is played when swiping the top bar. The power off and lock screen buttons have moved to the top right under a sub drop down menu. Locking the screen now powers down the display instead of just dropping you off at the lock screen. While the dedicated settings button has been removed for the time being, quick access to the settings can still be used by clicking on the battery level. This is also true for the inactivity timeout, which now also powers down the display. Thumbnails has entered the last stage of testing before it gets put into the update repo. This improves multi app workflows significantly. Texting via XMPP is now baked directly into chats, enabling yet another way for you to communicate with your friends and family on the Libre 5. You can also see it integrates well with regular SMS when you power on the modem. The temperature monitor now works out of the box, giving you an easy way to keep an eye on the GPU, CPU, and battery temperature. LED feedback is slowly making its way into Feedback D. Applications will soon be able to take advantage of this silent notification. Using the latest version of Mesa, Chromium shows off what GPU acceleration can do on the Libre 5. Out of the box, the Chromium window is not sized correctly and the keyboard input is mismatched. However, both issues can be worked around by running a script after the initial launch. It's also beneficial to set a mobile user agent string. With those tweaks applied, Chromium is a fantastic option for browsing on the go. It offers effortless copy and paste and offloads much of the work to the GPU, saving you unnecessary CPU cycles. Pre-order your Libre 5 at puri.sm.